Luna Bees, how are you today? Today is week one of July's Movie Marquee Challenge that I am doing with Heather the Crochet Witch. Hi, Heather. <laughs> Hi, Abby. Uh, so, <clears throat> I this month was the month that I chose. <sighs> and it was, the movie was Full Metal Jacket. Jet, jet, jet. Full metal jacket. <laughs> um, I watched the movie last night. Totally forgot what the narrative of the whole thing was. It was pretty intense. Um, but I enjoyed it. It was a, a long time since I've seen that movie. So, <clears throat> yeah. Uh, but anyway... Um, if you don't know what I'm talking about, then there's a playlist that I will link and it's basically Heather and I, um, spell off every month. Um, she picks a movie, I pick a movie, she picks a movie, I pick a movie, and we're doing it all year long. And what we're doing is we're taking the movie poster from that movie and we're taking the colors out of it and we're making something. This time around, I'm going to, well in the theme of Full Metal Jacket, I'm going to attempt <laughs> to make a little bomber jacket, crochet a bomber jacket. Uh, <clears throat> so what I've done is I picked, now this, <clears throat> excuse me, this yarn I believe is only in Canada, not sure. But I'm sure that there's something in the States that is similar that you can use if you're planning on trying to do something like this. But I used Super Saver Brushed. Okay. Isn't that the perfect green? Perfect army green? Well, they're actually Navy Seals. But what? Or na they're Navy. Navy? Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> but they have these colors. Um... They're not Navy SEALs. They're just, anyway. Anyway. Uh, and then I found some, but I only found a few balls. I'm going to have to go back and see if they get any more. But I got the Red Heart Super Saver in the camo colors. I know. I'm the first one to say I hate Red Heart Super Saver. And I can honestly say I still don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> but um, it's the only thing I could get. They did have the Red Heart Comfort, but that stuff is even worse. Ugh, terrible stuff. So I'm kind of biting the bullet. Really? <laughs> okay, we're really going with the theme now, aren't we? <laughs> anyway. I'm just going to, I'm just going to do it. I'm going to work with this. It does kind of affect my fingers a bit. Um, I'm finding that I have to put some cream on my hands because it really sucks the, the liquidy out of your hands and dries out your hands and makes mine itchy. So, <clears throat> but that's okay. I, I'm going to, I'm going to get through it. Um, okay. So, this is how much I've gotten done so far it, because it took me so long to find the, um, the yarn. Oh, so I just got started on it. Okay. Oh, oops. It's upside down. I think. Is it upside down? Yeah, it's upside down. There you go. Isn't that cool? Um, this is definitely a yarn eater. Uh, this is a bag a day pattern, actually. I will leave that link down below. <clears throat> it's fun to do, though. It took, I had to frog this a couple of times um, in the first couple of rows. It kind of, I got all buggered up and, and, <clears throat> and I, it took me a little bit to get used to what I was supposed to do. But now I'm just like, oh, okay. But you have to be, 
really careful that you don't miss a stitch, right? Which is what I did. So, but I think it's turning out pretty good. So I'm not sure if I'm going to go this way, which I think looks really cool, or if I'm going to go this way. I haven't figured that out yet. <clears throat> I'm thinking of going this way because it does look really neat up and down like that. It looks more camo that way, I think, than this way. I don't know. Leave a comment down below and tell me what you guys think. <clears throat> so, because I can do it this way and it comes right to my my waist. So that would be bomberish. Um, this way, it's just to cover, you know, the... <laughs> it, well, this would be the back, ultimately, but... Um, yeah, but I, I, I really like it that way. I think it's kind of cool. So <clears throat> anyways, but I'm hoping that I'm going to be able to get more of this because I kind of wiped them out. They, I guess they just recently had a sale at Walmart and, uh, there was a lot of yarn that wasn't there. I was really shocked to see this color was actually on sale for $3. So I grabbed the few skeins that they had, but I thought, oh crap, maybe I don't, oh, no, shoot. I thought I had some more in my stash, but I don't. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to have to really keep an eye out. I mean, I've got all month, so mm. <laughs> who knows? It's Walmart, right? Uh, so I'm really hoping I can get this project finished. <clears throat> so, yeah. So that's what I'm doing, guys. Uh, so go check out Heather at the Crochet Witch. Go check out what she's doing. And I'm excited. I'm excited to see what she's going to what she's gonna do. Um, she has such cool concepts. Like she goes outside the box with a lot of her stuff. And I think, I don't think she's going to disappoint this month. Um, Cause I mean, she's doing all blankets, but they're all so different and they're really cool. They're really cool. I love every one of them that she's done. Uh, and yeah, so go check her out. Her link is going to always be down below and um for the whole year <clears throat> and yeah so don't forget to go to our facebook pages if you're getting involved in this one you don't have to do this movie you can do whatever movie you want just let us know what that movie is and when you um post your pictures uh so that we can go and take a look at the movie poster and see the color scheme right right <laughs> Okay, I don't think there's anything else I had to tell you guys. Um, but yeah, let me know down below. Do I do it? Oops. Do I do it this way? Do I do it this way? Okay. All right, guys. Thanks for joining me. Uh, I will see you next week. Okay. Love you all. Bye. Bye.